Even all remarks here, back again with another video, back again with another Oculus Quest video. And in this video, I'm going to show you the easiest way of adding custom tracks to your copy of Beat Saber on your Oculus Quest. So the Oculus Quest comes with a lot of tracks already, but on PC you can manually add as many as you want unofficially and play all your favourite tracks. Now you've probably seen some uh, videos over the last few days from other people showing methods of doing this, but this is a new method and it's easier. It's by the same people who brought you SideQuest, which I did a video on the other day, which enables you to sideload apps and experiences on your Quest that are not officially available. And it's using that system. They've now updated it to support this Beat Saber sort of modding mode. And I'm going to show you how you can be playing Mr. Blue Sky or more on your Oculus Quest. So let's show you how to add those custom tracks to your Oculus Quest. So first thing you need to do is watch my sideloading video and set up sideloading on your Oculus Quest. So the process can be a little bit complicated, but the great thing about this process is it is the easiest way of doing it. It uses a program called SideQuest, which is handy because it gives kind of the whole process a bit of a UI to make it easier to follow. So make sure you go through that video, go from start to finish, follow every single step. Next thing you need to do is make sure you've got the latest version of SideQuest if you're doing it for the first time you would have the latest version but if you've already installed SideQuest because you followed my video before uh, make sure you jump onto the page so sidequest.remarcus.com that'll take you to the page where you can download it click on releases and grab the latest version as of the launch of this video they would have uploaded the version that supports Beat Saber so make sure you grab that it does support Linux Mac and Windows so you have no excuse in giving this a go once you've done that and you've downloaded that to your desktop you get a zip file unpack that and then you go have a folder in there you have side quest double click it to open it so now you've got side quest open you can sort of see the sort of things you can already side load all these different apps and games and experiences are there but what we're interested in for this one is the beat saber or beast saber option uh, so in here it takes you to the beesaber.com website and it's as simple as clicking on songs choosing something so let's click top rank shall we find some songs, so we've got Mr. Blue Sky, I've already got this installed, but you can kind of scroll down, and we're looking for the little button to the right of the song that says add to side quest, you click that, it adds it to your library. You can sort of see on all these different songs so what difficulty levels they have, so Mr. Blue Sky has three, that one has three, that one only has two, so kind of bear that in mind. If you want a kind of an idea of how hard or difficult they are, there's a little play button here that kind of opens up like a, a little window I'll click this one actually, that shows you kind of like what it looks like in Beat Saber, how hard it is, how hard the notes are. There we go, you can kind of click play. So it'll play the song for you. You can get kind of an idea. So how hard or difficult it is, uh, whether, it, whether it's good, because at the end of the day, these are created by people all over the place. Some people create them better than others. Uh, that's just how it is. And at least you can, this way you can kind of have a little kind of mental sort of uh, note. Would you be able to do this? But if it's one you want, just literally click the add to side quest button to the right, and there we go. Then all you need to do is connect your Oculus Quest to your PC, so I've got these magnetic cables there, ping, and it's in. And if you give it a second at the top right hand here, you should get a nice green light that says it's all connected and working. And then we can just click on My Downloads, and it'll show you all the tracks that you've downloaded. So what you can do here is you can kind of choose to kind of turn things on and off. Let's turn everything off but Mr. Blue Sky, because, you know, I just want to play that for now. But what I would then do is create yourself a backup, click on Backups, and make a backup. That basically just kind of saves down your current copy of Beat Saber. And if there are any issues, you can restore that save. If you do have any other issues, you can kind of reset to a base version of Beat Saber. So that option's there and you can kind of start again. Uh, but so far I've had no kind of issues with this. So it's worked quite well. And once you've kind of selected all the tracks you want, you can click Sync Selected and Patch Beat Saber. And that'll then kind of create a APK file with those tracks you've selected included in it. And then we really need to click this screen here that says install APK to headset. Then that takes a few seconds. It's installing a fresh version with the new songs into your headset. And there we go. Bear in mind, the more songs you add, the longer that's going to take. But you know, if you want all those songs that you've got uh, your eye on, then you know, you're gonna have to wait for them sort of thing. But there we go. If you want to kind of remove any tracks, you just kind of click on delete on those, click on the three little dots and delete it. 
and then when you sort of refresh and upload a new version, those songs won't exist. And obviously these songs, if you untick them, they won't upload either. But then just boot up Beat Saber on your Oculus Quest, jump into the extras soundtrack here, and all your extra ones should be in here. So here's Mr. Blue Sky. You can choose the different difficulty levels here. We can click play. And there we go, custom music. And you can add literally hundreds of different tracks and it works quite well. Uh, I like these tracks from the Guardians of the Galaxy. If you've not seen that film, I highly recommend them. They are very funny and very good. But uh, let me know, what sort of tracks are you downloading? A little bit of uh, country maybe? Some rock and roll? Is What's missing from uh, Beat Saber that you wanted to add? Because I think Beat Saber and the custom tracks is a big part of what Beat Saber is about. So not having it a release was a bit of a shame, but now we have it. Although it still technically is unofficial. They are looking to add it officially, so hopefully we'll get that officially anyway at some point. But for now, big, big thumbs up. Well done to the uh, developers of SideQuest. It's uh, one guy, so if you haven't tried The Expanse, please do support the guy and download his app. Give it a go via SideQuest, install it. Um, give him sort of a bit of feedback and sort of... Uh, encouragement for the effort that he's put into this he's done a brilliant job big thumbs up to everybody who's had a hand in this so well done everybody oh and i'm messing up but uh let me know in the comments down below what you think did you find this video useful was the process quick and easy and painless give this video a thumbs up if you liked it thumbs down if you didn't that's fine i'm big enough and ugly enough to take it but do let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like it i'll try and do better for next time Become one of the remarkables, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to be notified when I next upload a video. And that's me done. I'm out. Have a virtual Beat Saber. High five. <laughs>